Greetings, friends. Just this week, I had the opportunity to visit my dentist again. I had uh, an appointment scheduled for back at the end of March, but that was uh, canceled at the time. And so uh, I go into the dentist office and there's some, a couple different protocols that they're uh, doing for the COVID-19. But one in particular is uh, the little suction thing they would put in your mouth, it used to be like a little tube, and now it's shaped like a leaf. And she was telling me that uh, they need to be able to, um, uh, needs to do some new things with regard to the present situation. And actually it was a much more comfortable uh, and uh, experience. It felt like it was a more efficient kind of suction kind of thing happening. And I just kept thinking, <clears throat> necessity is the mother of all invention. Right, this old axiom that we've heard before, necessity is the mother of of all invention. And isn't that true? Aren't there so many things that have been created and wonderful things out of necessity? And I think that this particular time that we're in, and although it places stress upon us in various ways, but it also places all kinds of opportunity. And all kinds of opportunity for people to be filled uh, with the gift of creativity. And so I was uh, noticing and encouraging people early on uh, to think of, you know, new ways to go about things and how to be creative during this time. And I was just excited to see recently that uh, one of our young people who graduated high school, their prom, as all of them were canceled, uh, but some couple parents uh, of close friends um, put together a little mini prom of just a couple of people uh, for their young people and uh, it felt like a good thing to do and it was a creative venture and how they went about it. We're experiencing the same thing with so many things right now but within the church as well. In two weeks, the last full week of July, the 27th through the 31st, we have Vacation Bible School, the week we normally do Vacation Bible School. But we will be doing it virtually, virtual Bible School or virtual Vacation Bible School, or some of us are calling it V2BS. <laughs> um, and we're having to be creative, having to use different technology and different ways of approaching uh, to offer something that we have offered in the past, but to present it in a new and different way. And so uh, we are doing that. Uh, many of you know we have a tradition of honoring our high school seniors uh, by uh, presenting them with blankets and providing an opportunity for parents to bless their young people and young people to bless their parents uh, and uh, in public worship. And so uh, we're going to have to do that differently. And so we're being creative about that. And so we're setting up appointments with specific uh, families for them to do uh, the time of blessing together and still receive their blanket by me, uh, but to have uh, still have the blessing, but just amongst the family. And uh, I expect it to be a really wonderful and enriching experience. We'll see. But again, necessity is the mother of all invention, uh, the gift of God's creativity. You know, under the pressure of a difficult situation, um, that pressure often can help creativity happen and can be the, the fire, the pressure that makes a diamond a diamond, a pressure uh, that creates a new thing, a, a new beautiful thing. So um, I invite you to look in your own circumstances in life uh, and look at um, what are the gifts of creativity that God is giving me to uh, employ uh, to create something new or look at something new in a different way and to see that, yes, God's grace is already present even amidst the struggles. And what am I being invited to do with it? And what am I being invited to create with it? So friends, May you know that God has blessed you and is blessing you with the gifts of grace and creativity during this time and all times. Happy inventing.